Repair Clinic encourages you to perform this procedure safely. In this video, we will show one or more of these icons to alert you when to use caution. To replace the thermistor in your dishwasher, you will need to uninstall the appliance first. To do this, turn off the power to your dishwasher and shut off the water supply valve. Use a Phillips head screwdriver to remove the screws, securing the lower access panel. Remove the panel. Use a 5 8 inch wrench to help unthread the water supply line from the inlet valve. Be prepared for some water to spill. Next, unthread the screw securing the junction box cover, then pull the cover off. Note the location of the wires, then untwist the wire nuts to disconnect the wires. Unthread the strain relief nut and detach the strain relief from the junction box. Next, disconnect the drain hose from the sink drain or garbage disposer and feed it through the cabinet. Open the dishwasher door and remove the mounting bracket screws. To move the dishwasher, you may need to adjust the legs to lower the appliance. You can lower the rear leveling leg by using a 964 inch hex head screwdriver to rotate the adjustment rod at the front clockwise. Now, very carefully pull the dishwasher away from the cabinet. Use the Phillips head screwdriver to unthread the screws, securing the right side access panel. Remove the panel. Use a 13 mm wrench to loosen the mounting nuts securing the noise filter and move the filter out of the way. Next, use the Phillips head screwdriver to unthread the mounting screws, securing the thermistor. Use pliers to help pull the old thermistor free of the pump housing. Disconnect the wire connector to fully remove. Install the new thermistor by first connecting the wire connector. Push the thermistor into place in the pump housing. and thread the screws to secure. Realign the noise filter on the base and tighten the mounting nut to secure. Replace the side access panel and secure it with the screws. The larger screw goes in the back. Make sure the drain hose is accessible through the cabinet wall and that the water and power supply lines are positioned in their respective channels in the dishwasher base. Now gently slide the dishwasher back into the cabinet. Adjust the leveling legs if necessary.
Replace the screws to secure the mounting brackets to the cabinet or countertop. Feed the drain hose through the cabinet and connect it to the sink drain or disposer. Make sure the hose is elevated above the connection point. Fully position the wire strain relief in the junction box and secure the strain relief nut Join the wires together and secure them with the wire nuts. Align the cover and replace the screw to secure. Reconnect the water supply line to the inlet valve. Replace the lower access panel and secure it with the screws. With the repair completed, turn the water supply back on, as well as the power and your dishwasher should be ready for use.